Is your organization facing skill gaps? According to a recent survey, 83% of HR professionals report that their organization is facing severe skill shortages in certain key areas of the organization. With an unemployment rate around 4% nationally and professional level unemployment rate at 2.5% and skilled trades even lower than that, it is likely that you are like the 83% facing skills gaps in the workforce. So the question is, how do you fulfill that skill gap? What works? So what organizations try varies, but a survey from SHRM indicated that HR professionals find four strategies to be most effective at filling skill gaps within their organization. So the first tactic that works is providing employees with on-site training. In other words, bringing training into the workplace environment and providing employees with the skills they need uh, to succeed and fill the gaps internally. Secondly, what HR professionals prefer are to start new training programs for new hires and for their existing workforce. This can be a combination of on-site training as well as sending employees out for training. Third is indeed sending employees outside the organization for training to acquire new skills. And four, offer higher levels of compensation. So basically, HR professionals are finding that training their existing workforce works best to fill the gap. Another survey throws a kind of a, a, a wrinkle into this equation. An international survey by Corn Ferry finds that global organizations are actually hiring for skill sets for positions that don't even exist in their organization. That's right, they're hiring people without having a job for them. This is especially true in high change and, and rapidly evolving positions uh, and technology areas such as artificial intelligence and cybersecurity. So what these organizations are determining is that they are in need of these skills in the future, but they've got to work now. They've got to act now to capture those skills um, and those individuals with those skills and develop them uh, further within their organization. So there's another uh, crazy strategy for you to contemplate. Another option is more of a long-term partnership. So many employers are finding that what they really need to do is to develop relationships with training providers, colleges, universities, community colleges, etc to create a pipeline of talent and to continually upgrade their, the skills of their uh, uh, talent pipeline through these long-term partnerships with education providers. So there's a few tips for you about how to fill the skills gap that you may have at your organization in the short term and the long term. And as an Employers Council member, remember, we are here to help you and support you. We have a variety of resources, services, and interventions that can help you fill the skills gap. We offer training on-site as well as in our office locations, and we can provide you that organizational strategic uh, assistance to develop effective training programs and employee development programs. Because it's not as simple as just sending folks off to a class. Um, there, there are other pieces to the puzzle such as testing and assessment and identifying promising candidates. So we have the tools, we have the services, resources, and the know-how. We're here to help you as Employers Council members. Have a great day. Thanks for listening.